recently launched and basically what cr the Creative Hub is, is a website where you can create mockups of advertisements and preview them like they're live. They actually will send you a version to your phone so you can see what a mobile version of your ad would look like. And you can also see all the different kinds of ads that Facebook offers so you can test out to see what your ad would look like if you did a carousel ad or a canvas ad, etc, etc. And there's also a really cool feature where you can take a look and see what some businesses or brands are doing for their Facebook ads and gather some inspiration and motivation to do awesome ads from that. So let's take a look. I'm going to show you guys how to do a really simple image ad and I'd love to hear your feedback. This is the Facebook Creative Hub dashboard. You can access it by going to facebook.com slash ad slash creative hub, or you can just go into your business manager and it's one of the options on the top left hand hamburger menu. So to create a mock-up, we'll choose what kind of ad we want to make. So you can go from interactive, video, image, or Instagram. I'm just going to show you quickly how to do a really simple image ad. And you'll see that the bottom here changed. We can actually view examples of other creatives that have been done for image ads, or we can create a mock-up, which is what we're going to click. So because you're doing a mock-up, there's not actually a live page that this will be tied to, so you can create a fake page. And in order to do that, you can do a fake profile picture. And I've already preloaded my business manager with really weird images that I found on the internet of people shrugging. I don't know, for some reason it was attractive to me. So we'll do your logo here. And then we'll enter in like a fake page name. So we can just call it our fake page. And if you look on the right hand side here, this will change period periodically just to show you what your ad is looking like right now. So text, um, learn how to shrug like a boss. And you'll see that it will change on this right hand side. And then we'll select an image. He looks like he would know how to shrug really well. I'll show here. And that's pretty much it for that part. Um, so you can do mobile newsfeed. It might just take a second. Feature phone. And then this is what it will look like on the right hand column of people's desktops. I usually disable the desktop right column view for ads because I don't find very good return on them. But I mean, if that's what you want to leave, then that's fine. And a really interesting feature is you can actually click send to mobile. And if your phone is logged in, you can actually view it on your phone and it will buzz and give you notification. And this is what it looks like. So it actually does legit look like a real Facebook ad. One of the cool features of Creative Hub is you can actually image text check your ad. So if you come up here, it says check that your ad meets our guidelines. So Facebook does have guidelines. If your image has more than 20% of text in it, it will limit the reach. So it will limit the audience that actually sees your ad. Depending on the amount of text in your ad, it will either flag it as low, medium, or high, but in this case, because there's virtually no text except for the horrible copyright watermark on my stock photo, um, they said it was okay. So um, our ad will run normally. We'll hit save, and we'll just call it November 30th, or 30th um, ad for approval or whatever you want to call it. It will save your mock-up. Might take a second. And then I'll show you another really cool feature. So when you click this share arrow, it actually gives you a link that you can copy, paste in an email and send that off to your client. And I'll show you how it looks from a client's perspective. So what I did was I copied that link that Facebook gave us 
and I pasted it into my browser and this is what your client or your boss would see. So they can look at the desktop version, the mobile version, and they actually have the option of sending it to their mobile phone, which is pretty neat. So they'll say, see that same view that I just showed you earlier on my phone. And that's pretty much Creative Hub. You can play around with all the different features, test out different ads. It's really great just to get your foot in the door if you're just starting off with Facebook advertising and it makes getting ad approval super simple. So that's the new Facebook Creator Hub. What do you guys think about it? Are you going to be using it? I actually personally used it today for one of my clients to send them the ads to get their approval and it was really neat because it it legit, like I didn't have to take a screenshot this time. I could just send them a copy of the ad and they could look at it like it was live. So I've already been finding it useful, but I'd love to hear your guys' feedback after you try it. Um, and before I let you go, I just wanted to let you know that I did start a new Facebook page. It's called Social Media with Beverly Teresa. You can find it at facebook.com slash hello Beverly with, and that's Beverly with an L-E-Y. Um, if you go like it, you can stay up to date with industry trends. I throw up some tips. I'm going to be throwing up some free downloads and things like that. So I'd really appreciate it if you could follow me on Facebook. And as always, if you want to connect with me on other social media platforms, my username is at Hello Beverly. That's Beverly with an L-E-Y. And yeah, so until next week, I guess, um, bye, Felicia. Bye, Felipe. Bye, Felicia. Bye. Just bye.